Hi, it's Dave Robinson with PlantCoverCrops.com here on uh, April 27th, a couple days after Easter here in the last week of April. We're looking at some cover crop plots. We finally have gotten some warmer weather and uh, we've had uh, about five inches of rain the last uh, week and a half. So we're too wet to do some digging in the, uh, or to plow the garden. So we're gonna look at some cover crops. These are our peas right here that survived uh, through the winter and uh, they're looking pretty good. They're not real tall, but you can see here as we pull that up, just almost a foot tall. So what we're gonna do now is uh, we're gonna look and see if we have some nodulation going on on the peas. Now obviously we don't have this checked out yet and uh, I have not uh, figured out whether we do or don't. So as we look in here closer, we, as we can see here right on the on the line here, we've got a number of nodules here on the peas, and uh, that's good. I know we've seen some in uh, previous plots where we had uh, them almost the size of a dime. I don't have that here, that size, but I do have some decent sized nodules, and uh, a lot of them, look at that. That's good. I'm producing nitrogen here, even though my soils are too wet to be able to plant. I've got a significant amount of rooting, a lot of nodules here, and uh, that's pretty exciting here the last uh, week of April. Obviously, it would have been nice to have already either turned this over or to have planted the garden. Most farmers would have rather had their, their uh, farms planted other than producing more nitrogen from their peas. But nevertheless, here we are with another set some decent sized nodules down here. Here we get our large sized nodules. That's, that's impressive. And here we are five, six, seven inches underneath, or well, five inches underneath the surface of the soil. Again, Dave Robison, plantcovercrops.com on April 27th, 2011. Looking at the nodulation on our peas uh, while our soil is too wet to get our crop planted.